What is up, you guys? Welcome back to another one. If you're new to the channel, I am Gold Pony. This is Gold Pony Crypto itself. I know what you're probably thinking. Why is everything red today? Because today we are going to be going over the Ruby Steel card and why I believe it is still worth it to get this thing in 2023. So ultimately in this video, I'm going to be giving you those five reasons why it's still worth getting the Ruby Steel card in 2023. And I know what some people have been with Crypto.com for a while are thinking. The card rates have been cut and it's no longer what it once was. And while that may be true, it is still worth it to get the Ruby Steel if you're just starting out here with Crypto.com. And if you've watched my prior videos, this is the card I started out with. I loved it. I had it for the longest time and then I upgraded to Jade Green. I still use the Crypto.com card every single day. It is my go-to card. So again, in this video, I'm going to be giving you five reasons why it's still worth getting in 2023. But before we get started, nothing in this video should be considered financial advice. Please do your own research. This is simply for educational and entertainment purposes. And if at some point in this video, you find yourself thinking, I want to get a Ruby Steel card as well, go ahead and use my referral code once you log into the crypto.com app it is simply gold pony all lowercase all one word all you need to do is type in gold pony that gives you a free 25 dollars worth of crow but it gets better because this isn't a regular referral code i actually have a partnership with crypto.com so while you and i get that 25 dollars worth of crow we both get it actually so that's kind of cool but you also get more than that you also get a free 10 dollars worth of crow if you spend a hundred dollars on the card within the first 30 days of signing up and you get another Another $10 worth of crow if you spend $500 within the first 30 days on the crypto.com app. So that is why it's more beneficial to you to use a crypto.com partner like myself. And I actually used another YouTuber's referral code when I originally signed up for this as well. So anyways, let's just go ahead and get started. And so what the Ruby Steel card actually is, it's a prepaid Visa debit card, meaning it is a Visa card. So it's accepted anywhere Visa is accepted, which is pretty much everywhere at this point. It's also a prepaid paid card meaning you actually top it up with fiat or you can top it up with crypto as well but for me i usually just top it up with fiat aka the dollar because i'm here in the us and then i just enjoy the crypto back rewards in the form of crow and we're going to get to that in a second but it is also a metal card as well so you're going to feel like a baller when you use it i'm just saying and so just to start out real quick how to go about getting one of these cards simply pull up your phone go to the app store if you're on apple or go to the play store if you're on android download the crypto.com app and then in the bottom right hand corner it's going to give you that option to go ahead and hit card and sign up for the card that you pick. Again, I currently have the Jade Green, but today we're going to be going over the Ruby Steel. And so in addition to that, as far as topping up this card goes, like I said, you can use crypto. It's a good way to cash out near the top, perhaps, if you want to go that strategy. But I personally use fiat. So I actually have my day job linked with the crypto.com app. And so whenever I get paid every single Friday, it goes into my crypto.com app. And then I can use that to actually top up the Ruby Steel card, which I did use when I had the Ruby Steel card. Now it's just just topping up the jade green card basically but that way it is completely free there's no fees whatsoever when you do it through direct deposit or ACH transfer the bank to bank transfer there's no fees whatsoever so you're not losing anything there but I will say if you use maybe your traditional bank's debit card this is going to be a 1% fee and I still use that from time to time when I know I have a big purchase coming up or if you want to use a credit card that's going to be a 2% fee which I probably wouldn't recommend using that because there's of course better options out there and so the next question I know a lot of people are going to have is when you go to the crypto.com website, it says that it's required a lockup of $400 in Crow for a period of six months. After that six months is up though, you can do whatever you want with that lockup. You can keep it in there and keep earning the rewards that I'm gonna tell you guys about in a second, or you can take it out. You can get that $400 worth of Crow, whatever the current value is, I'll put it that way. You can take that back out and invest it in Bitcoin, but I will see you lose the rewards if you do that. So I still haven't done that. I still have yet to take out my stake in the crypto.com card basically so but like I said that $400 that you put in it's going to adjust dependent upon the value of crow for example when I first staked for this ruby steel I staked for it when it was five cents and then of course crow went up to approximately a dollar almost it went up to 96 cents and then I upgraded to the jade green when it was at around 90 cents so at this point of the game in the middle of the bear market when the price of crow is so low really it has a lot of room for growth and again that's not financial advice but 
Just take, for example, what happened to me in the last bull run and this next bull run that's about to be. The price of crow is at seven cents right now. It's very possible it could go back up to nearly a dollar, if not past that dollar. So you might end up making a good bit of money by simply just locking up that $400 for this card and leaving it there. I'm just saying. All right, and so, but now let's go ahead and get into the five reasons why it's still worth it to get the Ruby Steel card in 2023, starting with the 1% cash back in the form of crow on all purchases. Again, this card is accepted anywhere Visa is accepted. So when you go to get groceries, when you go to the movies, when you go to a restaurant, you can actually pay bills with it as well. I pay my phone bill with the card, also pay my TV bill with the card. There's health insurance costs here in the US that you can pay with the card and you get Crow back for that as well. And I will say as far as disclaimers go, there's a max of 25 US dollars that you can earn in Crow per month. But then come the first of that next month, it resets back to zero so you can continue earning yet again until you top out at that max of $25 worth of Crow. And although I alluded to this earlier, I know what some people say with, uh, I have to pay a 1% fee to top it up using my debit card, which I do quite often. And then they're thinking, why is it worth it if I have to pay 1% just to get 1% back? it's not worth it. But if you think about it, it is. Because you're getting that 1% back, not in US dollars, which is the fee that you're paying, but rather the price of Crow. So if you believe that the price of Crow is going to increase like it did for me in the last bull run, it gave me over a 20X, then you're not just getting 1% back, you're getting 20% back if you think of it that way, so long as you sell that top at least. But that is why it's still worth it in my mind, unless you think the price of Crow is going to go down, in which case this is not the card for you because this is a crypto.com card. But if you believe in crypto.com, and we'll get more into why I believe in it later in the video, but what I believe is that the price of Crow is going to go up in this next bull run. Therefore, the 1% is going to quickly turn into two, five, 10, 20% possibly, just like it did for me in the last bull run because I'm getting all these returns right now when crow is at seven cents and if I leave it there it's only going to increase in value and the other thing I want to mention with the crypto.com cards a lot of people will say why don't you just stake it in the crypto.com DeFi wallet rather than locking up your crow and the centralized app for the card my response to that one is why not do both I mean yes yeah, staking in the crypto.com app to earn 10% of your crow is great but at the same time why not do both the thing is only $400 to lock up and you get crow back in all of your purchases so for me the second best option is either use my traditional debit card which gets me nothing back or use my credit card which gets me a little bit back but it gets me a back in dollars and the dollar is only decreasing in value whereas crow during this next bull run is going to increase in value in my opinion so anyways let's now get to my number two which is the fact that it is a middle card here let me get something actually banging against here i don't know maybe scissors Hey, it's metal, just take my word for it. Cool thing about it being a metal card is it's a lot heavier than your traditional cards are gonna be. And I've said this in some of my other videos, when you go through maybe a fast food drive through line or something, so many people will comment on the card and how heavy it is. They'll be like, oh, it's so heavy. Like it went, I went through Taco Bell and somebody said that, or if I go to the dollar store, somebody will say that no matter where I go, if I hand this card to somebody, somebody will comment on why it is so heavy because 99% of cards out there are plastic and this one is 100% metal, which is pretty stinking cool. Number three reason to get this in 2023 is the 100% reimbursement for Spotify up to $13.99 per month, and that goes for six months. So if you do have Spotify right now, you get it completely back. All you need to do is link up your Spotify account with this particular crypto.com card, the numbers on the back, of course, and then whenever that Spotify gets taken out of the card, the crypto.com app is automatically gonna debit that back to you, that $13.99 in Crow. So it's gonna be a decent amount back. At this time, it might be 200, 250 Crow or something like that. So again, at all time high, that's 200, 250 bucks back if you sell at the top. So that's pretty cool as well. Number four on my list is if you have topped this card up already, you can actually get free ATM withdrawals up to $400. And that's per month, by the way. And you can actually withdraw up to $10,000 per month as well. So again, another way you can actually cash out for your crypto gains at the top of the bull market if you wanted to do that. And so last reason number five on my list is the crypto.com brand, the company itself, and it's incredible marketing that it does. It literally, in my opinion, is the very best at marketing. It has the most name recognition out there right now, which is partly the reason why I went from five to 96 cents last bull run. So you guys may have heard about the Staples Center. The naming rights for that stadium has been bought by crypto.com. It is now the crypto.com arena, which is where the Lakers play and a ton of other sporting events and other just general events are held. So you got the 
Decrypted.com Arena. You got the Matt Damon commercials. You guys probably remember those. You got the LeBron James commercials. You got the partnership with Formula One. You got the partnership with Aston Martin. You got the largest sponsorship deal ever with the UFC. So whenever you watch a UFC fight, you see the Crypto.com logo absolutely everywhere on the Octagon, on all the uniforms, like absolutely everywhere. Also, they're patch partners with the Philadelphia 76ers being in Pennsylvania. That is very cool for me. And then you also have the expansion of the Kronos chain, which is Crypto.com's layer one blockchain, essentially. So for those of you who are not familiar with the Kronos chain, it actually has a higher total value locked than other blockchains like Solana. Like Algorand, it actually has more than double the TVL of Cardano as well. So it is actually a very popular layer one chain right now. And this next bull run, I see no reason why it does not absolutely crush it. And to go along with that, you also have the Crypto.com DeFi wallet and you have more regulatory approvals than really any other exchange out there. Crypto.com has gotten approvals in some of the most difficult countries to get approvals in, including let's just say Singapore, where Binance did not get an approval, unfortunately for them. But anyways, like I said, if you did want to pick up a Ruby Steel Crypto.com Metal Visa card, go ahead and use my referral code Gold Pony. It's going to give you a free $25 worth of crow and possibly $45 worth of crow. And by the way, full details on that is down in the description box below in case you're curious. I also get $25 worth of crow in case you were curious so you get to support the channel at the same time and i do appreciate it if you do end up using the code but anyways that is about it for this one you guys thank you so much for watching feel free to follow me on social media for different cryptocurrency updates be sure to hit the subscribe and the bell notification button if you're into crypto.com crow and chronos because that is what we do here on this channel after all do appreciate you guys watching more than you know i will see you guys all in the next video stay gold